what's up guys welcome back to the next video yeah people make up to all my viewers and all my subscribers yeah people you know, thank you guys for your support you know yeah man so guys we're making you know, concrete plant pot but um this is, is a ice called the antique concrete plant pot you know antique people yeah yeah i mean some country might call it pedal stall you know but i style the wine glass antique wine glass so guys so we have the template here the template is basically to the top of the pot template and this is for the base so guys so all you need is two templates one for the base one for the top of the pot and when we finish we're going to assemble them guys so we have a shoulder here right and we have a wheel the people the wheel and the shoulder so the, the template is going to be installed in the shoulder so guys take around watch the entire video guys and guys remember guys if you're new around here please guys smash that subscribe button so we're making this pot right down here this pot right here we make it people so stick around people so guys i'm going to install my template now this is the template to the top. Right, people, remember that we're making an antique, antique wine glass, concrete planter. Right, people, the, um, the shoulder have on two screws. In fact, three screws. One, two, three. So you can open them up. Open the screws. Get in your template. And when you finish, now you just lock back the screws now. Lock the screws to get the fast in the template, right, people? Just have My template here, I'm gonna show could go in and out. Okay, people, so we have your pallet here. Pallet, guys. So the part gonna be on top of that. The ramo to compact them, to compact our clay. Right. Yeah guys, so we yeah we clay down here now people. This stuff here gonna be on the inside of the pot. So guys, this stuff that I'm using here is basically 50% sand and 50% clay right check compact clay inside here compact it compact it trace some more compact properly Them. We have a nice compact clay there. Right? So guys, we're going to start making a beautiful wine glass concrete plant now. Guys, so the pot is going to take the shape of the template, people. Right? So, this template that I have here, the exact way the pot is going to look. Guys, you want to you want to press in to the hands while you were spinning. I don't have to be compact. So when you when you put on your, your cement, it wouldn't fall apart. And as you can see, the the clay is taking the shape of the template now. Finish molding now, people. I finish molding. So guys, what I'm gonna do now? I'm gonna tap back, tap back my shoulder to form, to form the thickness of my pot, people. So between here, guys, between here, it's gonna be the thickness of my plant pot. I usually use about half inch, right, guys? But what? You want to have your plant pot nice and smooth, guys. Next set of clay or the unwanted clay. You take it off of the pallet. And guys, there we have our wine glass molding. 
or antique wine glass molding. So guys, if you're new here guys, please people, support the thing guys, subscribe, like the videos people, share people. Guys, so what I do, I use, um, I would use four parts sand, two parts cement for my mix, right people? There's a, there's a pong, one pong container here, right? Average, a pong container, four parts sand, plus two sand there, three sand, four sand, and two cement. And two. We go again with the same process. Four sand. One. Three. Four. Two cement. People and just mix like when I mix some water. So guys, we get now we um cement here. No. Guys, rain just, rain just finished falling. So like, the atmosphere a bit cold. The path will take more long to dry. So guys, in cold atmosphere, paths usually take long to dry. When it's hot, dry fast. Guys, you have to take your time and turn. Because you don't want it to break up, you know? Take your time and turn. So guys, please leave in the comment section. Leave a comment and let me know if you guys love this can this, um, this part here. If you love this part, and you can also comment and let me know what what other designer part you guys would like to see. All right, people. Let the people comment below. Let me know. I love this part. Personally, I love this part here. Yeah. Real nice part. Hey guys, our part is finishing up here now. The motor part. As soon as time for our slick. With the cement and water. Okay, people, so make them a slick now. I have my safety here. You have to go sometimes, sometimes the cement might have been small bits of stuff inside. So what I, what I do, I sift my cement. My people, whatever, whatever, whatever small particles in the cement wouldn't go in the stick, you see guys? Let me show you all of that here. Right, we, want to be, uh, we want to stick nice and smooth. If you any, any any particles in the stick, we're going to leave an impression on the pot, we're going to scratch the pot. Yeah, guys, this is the finished slick now. 
so we're gonna get a pot slip now people yeah so guys we just basically flowering flowering the pot now you call it flowering Nice, you know? Yeah, guys. Oh, okay. See people, beautiful. So, guys, our wine glass stop is finished. And I know you're not taking the trouble. If I give a final smooth paper, and boom, there we have it. Our beautiful antique wine glass concrete planter so guys this is the top of the wine glass so we're going to make the base now guys so stay tuned don't go nowhere yes guys so that day we'll leave here for dry for 24 hours and then we'll get back and assemble it so guys this template here is to make the base so we're going to set the guys we're going to make the base for the wine glass my right, people because now it's making two pieces Making two pieces, and get the base, then get actual wine glass, then we're gonna assemble it. So guys stay tuned, watch the entire video to see the entire process. Yeah, so guys you just lock out the nut as you know. Okay. Let's see us come back. Hey guys, so we're making our base for our antique carpet plant pot.
Yeah, guys, and there we have our molin for our base. Here, yeah, people, getting the mortar on top of the on top of our base. Our base for our wine glass planter or antique wine glass planter. Yeah guys, so we're flowering our base now. Flowering it. I get it slick. or base finish now. So guys continue watching the video and when it's time for the pot assemble you guys would see why I cut the hole on top of the base. And people, so watch the entire video. And you see the reason why I cut this hole down here. Guys, our beat finished. People, our beat, our beat finished. So, guys, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna leave the base down here to dry for 24 hours. Yeah, guys, 24 hours gone now. So, what we're gonna do now? We can get them, get them to go there. The base. I'll take off the base now to get out because remember, the 24 hours gone. And then we go take off the top now, guys, and get the dig out. Yeah guys, so we have our base, we have our base here for our white wine glass, our antique wine glass. Yeah guys, so this guy is kind of heavy, so this requires two persons to lift. We're going to clear out of this now people, you know? They're going to clear, the shovel, and people to clear. now the base of the pot 
to stop up the pot. We're gonna assemble them now. PVC pipe, some nails. Set nails, these set nails down and these set up. We're gonna do now, we can make some concrete and pour in there. Hey okay, guys, you got some gravel here? Gravel, sand, and cement. Cement. Mix them together now. Make a little, little concrete. To pour in here. So basically, guys, basically what we're doing, we're fastening the base with the top. Right, guys? The base with the top. Pour now. So guys, make sure you use gravel in the in the mixture. A little gravel. They're going to make the um make the concrete more solid, so the base wood wouldn't break off from the from the wine glass top. Okay, yeah, here take a shovel and just smooth it now. Nice and neat. Take some water. Just wash off your pot. Guys, so you don't want your pot to mess you. You want your pot to remain clean and nice. So guys, here we have it. So guys, just gonna leave here again for the next 24 hours. That's it because what I, what I just finished doing there, I just basically fasten the base with the top of the wine glass. Like the video, share the video, subscribe. So guys, for today, make um, three days since we're working on the pot, right? It's a third day today. Just be working on the pot, guys. You know. So that's basically now. So flick it out, go polish, and there we get it paint. So guys, there's the hole down here for water to run out of the pot. There's a hole there. I blacked up yesterday before gas. You know. So. Nice it up, and then. Oh, you know. Here we have our um, wine glass now. Okay, here we have our wine glass, people. Huh? Our beautiful antique wine glass pot. Yeah, people. So, guys, we're doing. Check your side. Okay, check your side there. See? We have the hole there for the water to run out. Remember, said, guys, it can't be a plant pot without a hole inside. Right? For the water drain. Okay, yeah, guys, we make some polish here. What we call it stick here. Basically, you cement mixed with water. Right. But make it thin, eh? Make it thin, well thin. Not thick. So we're gonna um get a pal the pot polish out now. Antique wine glass concrete planter. Hey guys, some countries might call it pedestal. So you know what? 
I called my wine glass to be fun. So you guys see inside nice and smooth? So guys, what I'm going to do now guys, leave it for dry for a few hours and then I'm, I'm going to paint the, the entire pot. Yeah guys, so the pot finish um, drying again for a few hours. Yeah. Very nice you now people. Check. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to put on some white paint people. And guys, I mean you can paint your pot in whatever color you want to, but I love white, you know. Because to me, white is standard. So, put on some white paint here so now, people, and I'm good to go. You can put on to coat the paint if you want. Hey right, people. I continue the motor, just take your time on the mouth. Make the mouth nice and smooth. Yeah guys, if you love to see videos like this, how to make antique campy flower pots, guys, good right now. And subscribe to my channel because people my channel make videos like this and people how to make beautiful antique county plant pots right guys people please like subscribe and share the videos people so guys here we have it our beautiful antique concrete planted so people thanks for watching the video All right guys and please remember to like subscribe and share the video peace out people see you in my next video